So today's topic is um, dream chasing. And one thing you have to realize about a dream is that a dream is a journey. If you've noticed, today I'm not in the gym, but instead I'm walking in the park. And as we go on this journey to dream chasing, one thing that we have to truly realize is that a dream is something that happens when you realize what your true potential is. See, for me, myself, I got a book called Sacked Out right now. And one thing you got to realize is I would have never been able to write that book if I didn't realize what my true potential is. I struggled at one point in time um, with emails, sending emails to my boss and not even doing them correctly. And he was on me constantly because of that. But I didn't let that stop me. See, this journey that we're going on, it, once you realize your true potential, then you can begin to dream. But at some point, you got to make those dreams become reality. And as I'm walking down here at this park, one thing that I quickly realized is as I'm passing stuff like big trees just like this, I realized that those trees represent the obstacles that we're going to go through on this journey. And what it does is it stops us from dreaming and it allows our reality to become lower than what it really needs to be. See, the dreams that you have are the same dreams that somebody else in this world has as well. Where our dreams are no, have no perspective of man. Um, just because you are who you are doesn't mean that you're going to accomplish what you need to accomplish if you don't put action and, and put faith into what, what it is that you need to do. See, my dreams that I'm going to achieve is going to help somebody else. So I challenge you that everything that you dream of right now that you begin to start to do what it takes to make it reality. Because you're not achieving your dreams, you're keeping somebody else from not achieving theirs. What if the person that was supposed to help you achieve your dreams, what if he gave up? What if she said, I can't do this? There's somebody that's looking at you right now that's saying, if he can do it, I know I can do it. So I challenge you that that dream chasing that you're doing, don't give up. Even when times get hard, even when times get tough. Even when you feel like, I can't do this no more. I'm here to tell you that you can. Because one thing that I do know is that if it was easy, everybody would be doing it. But it's not. The times that you're going through, everything that, you, that you've gone through, whether difficult or not, it was for a reason. Because if it was e like I said, if it was easy, everybody would be doing it, but they're not. Now I'm going to show you this picture and I'm going to tell you what it represents. This right here represents the stop. I want you to stop and think about what it is that you're truly trying to do. Stop and think about what your true potential is. Stop and think about what it is, where it is that you're truly trying to be. And then, at that point, I want you to dream again. Today's topic, we talked about dream chasing. And if you're ready to truly dream chase, I challenge you to not get caught up with what you don't have, but start with what you do have and wake up.